Today I'll go through how to create an image grid for your page where for example you can have each image link out to a different page either on your site or another site for feature projects for example. So first I'm going to pick a layout for my page and get an idea of where the image grid is going to go. Then I'll add the text app right here which is the app that we'll use to create the image grid. I'll go ahead and delete the default text here just by backspacing and removing that text and then I'll click insert image so I can start adding my images for the grid. I already have some images saved for my grid here um, which had the same dimensions but if you need to you can always use our built-in resizing and cropping tools uh, once you add your images. So once my first image is uploaded on my page and added I can um, add some spaces here to put some padding or separation between the images. So you can feel free to use a few spaces or none at all depending on how you want your grid to look. Um, then you just continue to add images in the same way. So just continue clicking the insert image option, add your images, and you probably want to have the same uh, spacing or padding in between the images um, So just to keep it consistent. Um, once you get to the end of a row, let's say you want to have four images, you can hit your, rec uh, your return or enter key just to jump down to the next line and then continue adding your images. If you'd like to have your images link out to another page on your site or maybe an outside URL, you can select the link option when you're in your image editor and then pick the linking um, option or add the link that you'd like to for wherever you'd like your visitors to go once they click the image. So this is how you can create an image grid on your site using the text app. Thanks for watching.